Stay tuned and watch the whole video. So we're here in a casino in California where you definitely have to wear a mask, but the issue that I'm having is we just went inside and dined, ate inside a building, eating food, and in here in California, you're supposed to go ahead and eat everything outside because that's what the governor said. So we found out not too many weeks ago that you can actually come to the casino. So this is the first time we're actually out doing this. And yeah, I just amazed and I had a conversation with the guy that seated us and he told us because if it's a it's a sovereign nation and that's why any casinos in California you can sit down and eat. So this is one heck of a smart virus that it won't affect you here in a sovereign nation. So it just amazes me that that I just feel that this is a bunch of BS and it's all political. They were actually practicing social distancing here. So you had your mask on while you're walking to the table. You know, they didn't have as many tables and, uh, you know, so it's like if it works here in a sovereign nation as the casino, I don't see why we can't have buildings open in other parts of California, like if we travel out of, out of this casino, we go down the road a little bit and we stop someplace, we can't eat inside, we have to eat outside, and you can't go into a building, you have to do things outside, like you can't have church inside, but as some of the pictures you saw, there's plenty of people inside having a mask on, so social distancing, and you know, it just amazes me how smart this virus is. You can come to, like I said, in, in India Casino, and you can do all these things that you can't do on uh, off sovereign nation. So, Governor, Gavin Newsom, you're full of it. You need to be in prison. And I hope your day comes real soon. Actually, I want an apology from you saying, I'm sorry for putting California through what you have put us through. I'm really happy that me and my wife got to enjoy an evening here, dinner out inside a building with air conditioning when it's hot, smoky here in California. So me and my wife were just sitting in the car talking about um, some scripture that we possibly could read and it's like I get so upset just everything that I see going on and um, she was saying about you know some of the words I use it's just I'm so frustrated you just wouldn't believe and it's like this is just going to continue to go on until the election. So got a verse that I'd like to read. Um, it's out of Job 4, 8. As I have observed, those who plow evil and those who sow trouble reap it. So, like I was saying before, the people that are controlling us and telling us what to do and they're not doing it truthfully, they're gonna reap what they sow. Whether in this lifetime or the next lifetime. And I have 2 Chronicles 19, 7. And now, may the terror of the Lord be on you. Watch what you do, for there is no injustice or partiality or taking bribes with the Lord our God. So if you're not being truthful or you're doing something to make money and to hurt California, yes, you're going to be judged always on the bottom of our videos down here we're gonna have a link to another video where you can give your life 
to Christ. Later on, um, we would like to know if you did that, and you can contact us in many ways. And again, we'd have the links down there on how you can do that. We would really like it if you go ahead and subscribe here. Go ahead and give a thumbs up, and then we'd really like it because if you click on the bell, you would be notified when a brand new video gets posted to our channel. This is Jedi's for Jesus.